speaker this afternoon is uh, Damian Araujo. Damian is a postdoc in the University of uh, Florida. And Damian is going to talk today about geometric approach to no variational singular degenerate elliptic equations. Thank you, Felipe. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. Uh, today I want to talk about uh, some rewrite theory for degenerate singular equations, okay? But I want to first want to make a short review about uh, fully nonlinear equations. Uh, let's consider an uh, operator uh, from the symmetric uh, space uh, to real line, okay? And under uh, the elliptic condition, okay, elliptic condition, uh, let's keep in mind uh, that, that condition, uh, the positive constant, okay, mm. uniformly elliptic condition, okay? Uh, our main prototype is, is Laplace. When you consider trace, and we have some facts about that, that equation. Uh, first one is solutions are C1 alpha. It's due uh, Keffer. Uh, second one is solutions in general are not C11. There's no hope to, to get uh, C2 estimates for this class of, of operators, okay? But if you add a uh, concavity assumption, uh, we can prove it that, that, that estimate. Solutions can be C2 alpha, or C2, C2 alpha, C2 alpha. It's due Evan Skrilov, okay? Uh, here, uh, we trace about um, some general equations where uh, the elliptic constants degenerate on that singular set, right? And in first work with the shader, we consider the following class of equations where we have that prototype, okay? Uh, which means uh, the, that elliptic constant or elliptic condition degenerates in that order, okay? And the singular set uh, turns out uh, that, that, that set, okay, positive the boundary of the positive set. Uh, gamma here is considered uh, between zero and one. Nice. Uh, we, can, we, can, we can make a, a relation. Uh, it's a, a non-versional uh, approach, right? Uh, if, you, if you relate, uh, we can relate uh, for a, a variational approach. Alt Phillips uh, developed uh, uh, that, that similar case for minimize of that, that, that functional, okay? for gamma between 0, 1, 2, okay? Uh, we have some, uh, some facts about that, that singular equation, okay? Uh, first one is C1 classical regular cannot be applied for this case because you lost the, the diffusion properties, right? Uh, it's not, cannot be applied immediately, right? Uh, second one, fact two, uh, there is no hope to, to get a C2 uh, estimates, uh, which means uh, the Hessian uh, blows up, right, when you are close to the singular set. But we have a, a, a chance, right, to understand more uh, how precisely is that, that, that regularity for solutions for that singular case. How about C1 alpha estimates, okay? Well, we have uh, good news about that. Uh, solutions, indeed, solutions are C1 beta. For uh, explicit, explicit uh, beta, uh, beta is, depends directly on, on the, the degree of singularity, and so the regularity is optimal, right? Uh, if you add, uh, if you add uh, some conditions about the, the, that solution, uh, in, uh, which means if you uh, consider 
solutions as a limit of Perron solutions, okay? Uh, we can obtain a lower control, and so we can have a, a if with, uh, with uh, the regularity, uh, we can have a, a total control, right? Uh, for for uh, points close to singular set, and then uh, that degree of the control it's given by the same exponent as uh, uh, in our last result. Okay. Uh, Geometrically, we have that situation. The solutions is approaching to, we are approaching to, to the singular set, and we have a total control. It's important because we, uh, we can understand more precisely uh, how can, how uh, the solution uh, lost the diffusion process, okay? Uh, and, but, uh, in this case, uh, the solution can be some uh, important uh, properties uh, close to uh, the singular set. Anyway, uh, well, uh, we have uh, some consequences about that total control. First one is uh, we have a uniform positive density. Okay, we can we can we can show uh, that there is a, a minimal portion in the positive part. Uh, if you take a ball, a ball, right? You can guarantee a, a minimal part in uh, in a positive set, right? That that constant is universal, right? The second one is if you add some uh, concavity asymptotic assumption, uh, we can get a, a house of estimates, okay? Uh, about the the free boundary. Yes. Right. Uh, uh, we, uh, I will talk about you uh, the second work uh, related that 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 class of singular singular equations. Okay, with Teixeira and Ricard. In this case, uh, uh, we 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 work about uh, a general class class, but considering uh, that singular or degenerate term, okay, my power of the gradient, where it's which, which means uh, the constant uh, degenerates in an order of power of gradient in that singular set, okay? For any alpha, uh, any positive, I'm sorry, any positive set, theta, okay? Uh, our first main result about that is uh, optimal regularity, okay? Solutions are, are C1 alpha, where alpha is a competition between the alpha zero. Alpha zero, I'm sorry, is a, 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 a optimal, I can't think it's in there. Uh, optimal uh, is exponent of regularity uh, to the uh, homogeneous equation, okay? And another constant is, is depends directly on, on the degree of the uh, degeneration, okay? Generate situation. Um, if, you, if, you, if you have uh, I have a concave operator um, by C2 alpha estimates, you have uh, get a pure, a pure uh, 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 optimal uh, estimate regularity, okay? Also, uh, in that simple case, uh, it's a new result too, okay? Solutions should be R, I'm sorry, R uh, C1 half, okay? Uh, how can I prove that, that result? Eh? Uh, you use it, uh, a universal flatness improvement, okay? Flatness improvement. Uh, first, we should consider that equation under smallest condition, okay? And then um, we can we can put uh, that solution together so close than uh, solutions for, sorry, that equation. Okay, anyway. But 
but by, uh, by uh, uh, result, result uh, do um, Sylvester and, and Inbert, solutions uh, of this equation solves this equation. Okay, then uh, AG is a harmonic function. Okay, uh, you, you are close in uh, some sense, okay, or a good, good guy, okay? It, this guy can, can share some uh, regularity, rich regularity properties for you, and then we can get the following property for uh, a whole zero, universal whole zero, okay? You can get a, a difference between uh, u, super and u, minus uh, affine function, universal affine function, okay? In terms of his whole zero, right? And if you uh, now uh, use a uh, scaling arguments, you can get a second step of this, okay? You have a, uh, now a, a square, and so on. Uh, repeating that process key, key uh, times, we can get a, 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 a that situation, and for any k, right? So, for any r between zero and whole zero, okay, we can get that 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 estimate um, when l l l infinity is a uh, universal affine function, right? Uh, after that, we can conclude we have that that estimate, okay, for an r small r, and then you can get the C1 estimate, C1 alpha estimates. Alpha is a, a, a explicit term, okay. When alpha is yes, C1 alpha, when alpha is one, one plus theta, okay. We have some some consequences uh, uh, related to uh, theory of superconductivity, uh, regularity theory for P Laplacian, because you can understand uh, the, the the singular situation in the P Laplacian. Uh, we can see uh, a similar situation in, uh, for this this class class of of equations, okay, of operators. And infinity Laplacian too, okay? Under a, a, a no trivial class, you can get us, uh, some optimal results about that, that class, okay? Well, uh, I would like to talk about, uh, to the end, uh, end up, I would like to talk about the mixed problem, okay? When you consider uh, in the same time uh, the singular and degenerate term, okay? <coughs> And uh, this problem is open, uh, but we, we have a, a conjecture. Solutions should be uh, C1 alpha 2, where alpha is given by that, that situation, okay? Uh, Teixeira has proved uh, uh, that regularity for critical uh, in the, the singular set, okay? Uh, also, he has proved uh, some uh, continuity uh, results, like a compactness result, but, it's, uh, but I can't develop, develop uh, that situation uh, for this case, okay? Uh, it's interesting to, uh, to also uh, study uh, regularity for free, free boundary, okay? As uh, that, that singular set, SU. Uh, in singular case, you have that set, okay? It's an interesting problem too, okay? Uh, but I'd like to, to, to be briefly, okay? Uh, I'm concluding that here, sorry. Any question or comment?